Hi friends, this video has been made for the students who prepare for the TET exam in English medium. This is paper 2, Social Science. Today we begin with 6 standard unit 1. The topic is Prehistoric Period. I am not going to explain the lesson, rather we are going to learn the MCQs that is in fill in the blanks form. Because I have already said many times when we learn the questions along with the correct answer, we will be able to pick our answer among any choices. So please don't ask me for the choices since it varies from exam to exam. Fine. Let's begin with question number one. Early man collected his food by dash. I'll repeat the question. Early man collected his food by dash. Your answer, hunting. Question number two. Early man lived in dash. Early man lived in dash. Your answer is caves. Question number three. Dash was the first animal domesticated by prehistoric men. Dash was the first animal domesticated by prehistoric men. Your answer is dog. Question number four. Dogs were used for hunting because of their dash power. Dogs were used for hunting because of their dash power. Yes, you are right. Your answer is sniffing. Sniffing means the smelling power. Question number 5. Early man used dash tools. Early man used dash tools. Your answer is stone. Yes, they used the stone tools. Question number six. Dash sources help to know about the early man. I repeat the question. Dash sources help to know about the early man. Your answer. Archaeological sources. Yes. Question number seven. Paintings were drawn on dash and dash. We find paintings, prehistoric paintings. These paintings were found on dash and dash. Your answer is rocks and caves. Question number 8. History is a record of dash. Of course, you know the answer. History is a record of past events. Question number 9. In history... The past events are given in dash order. In history, the past events are given in dash order. Answer, chronological order. Question number 10. The word history is derived from dash, meaning dash. The word history is derived from dash, its meaning is dash. Your answer. The word history is derived from historia. That means learning by enquiry. Question number 11. Dash is the study of coins. Dash is the study of coins. Answer. Numismatics. Question number 12. Epigraphy is the study of dash. I repeat. Epigraphy is the study of dash. Your answer is inscription. Question number 13. Dhamma. That is D-H-A-M-M-A. -M -M -A. Dhamma is the Prakrit word for dash. Dhamma is the Prakrit word for dash. Your answer, Dharma. Of course, we pronounce the word with R silent. Since I want to differentiate, I gave the stress on R. 
fine question number 14 dharma is the sanskrit word which means dash keep thinking dharma is the sanskrit word which means dash yes the right answer is religious duty dharma means religious duty and it is a sanskrit word question number 15 the process of evolution is dash so how does the evolution take place think the answer the process of evolution is dash your answer is gradual yes the evolution takes place gradually here i just pass for the new viewers that if you have forgotten to subscribe my channel please do it now ring the bell choose all thank you for being my friend we'll continue question number 16 tanzania is situated in dash tanzania is situated in dash yes you are right your answer is africa question number 17 dash is the study of prehistoric humans remained materials used by them dash is the study of prehistoric humans remained materials used by them your answer is archaeology question number 18 harpoons and spear throwers were used by dash harpoons and spear throwers were used by dash your answer crow magnets question number 19 evidences about dash is found in germany evidences about dash is found in germany your answer is neanderthal question number 20 sharp weapons were made with the help of dash sharp weapons were made with the help of dash that is during prehistoric period yes your answer is flint question number 21 dash resulted in the changes of man's physique and color dash resulted in the changes of man's physique and color your answer climatic changes question number 22 the story of human evolution can be scientifically studied with the help of archaeology and dash of course we learn through archaeology and also one more source is there just keep thinking the story of human evolution can be scientifically studied with the help of archaeology and anthropology yes your answer is anthropology question number 23 the word anthropology is derived from two greek words dash and dash i repeat the question the word anthropology is derived from two greek words dash and dash your answer is the first one is anthropos which means man and the second one logos which means thought or reason so anthropos means man logos means thought or reason together form anthropology question number 24 early man's main occupation was dash early man's main occupation was dash your answer hunting question number 25 dash in france is the evidence for cromagnons cave living I repeat the question dash in france is the evidence for cromagnons cave living your answer lascars caves lascars caves 
Thank you for being with me. If this video is useful to you, please hit the like and share to your friends. We'll see you in the next video. Until then, bye.